Hey what is up everybody, GGTV here with day 9 of our special queen month. In this classic Europa and DLC review, we're looking at Under Pressure. This is probably my favorite queen song, and David Bowie also helped with the singing in this song. So I guess we could say that this is also a special treat for you Bowie fans out there. But is the song any fun to play? Let's find out. The drum shall start with the 8th beat on the blue hi-hat, with the yellow pad snare and green hi-hat opener here and there in the beat. There is also no pedal kicks in this section, and the section also returns a couple more times in the charge. After that you get the verse beat, which is a 4th beat on a normal hi-hat, with a hit on the blue hi-hat opener on every snare hit. The pedaling is fairly basic, so having to hit the blue symbol on each snare hit does spice up the beat a lot. The chorus is a semi-fast 2 hit beat, with kicks on each hit and some hits on the green symbol here and there. There is also some simple feels a few times in the charge, but mainly it's the beats that I mentioned. After the second chorus you get a slow 2 hit beat on the green and later the blue right symbol, which is using the yellow pad as the snare. This beat is fairly simple and not very fun, but the shark does have a drum solo, which starts off fairly simple with just hits and rolls on the thumbs, but at the end you get continuous pedaling with the hits and rolls, which is much tougher. The song ends with a 4 beat on the green right symbol, which does make the song much less repetitive. So overall I like the shot quite a bit, with all the different riffs, the drum solo and no breaks, I give the drum shot a 6.5 of the 10. The bass shall start with the main riff of the shot, which is drumming on the orange note, with the last one being three note alt strum, before a signal change and a semi short break before it repeats. This is more or less the riff you get the first half of the song. It sometimes changes the chords of the same riff, and also that you get some signal changes a few times. But other than that, it isn't much else. The first chorus is strumming with some fun but simple hammer-ons to connect the strumming, and the second one removes the hammer-ons and replaces them with sustains and signal changes. After that you get a lot of sustains and long unmeasured breaks, before you get strumming again in a drum solo, with some sustains and signal changes to connect some of the strumming. This is where you get the most fun riff of the song though, which is a mix of two note old strumming, normal strumming, hammer-ons, signal changes and sustains. Overall this song was pretty boring at the start, but when you get after a halfway point, it actually becomes very enjoyable. I think you will enjoy this if you are after a simple shot, and it does evolve a lot from beginning to end. Just be ready for a slow start. I give the base shot a 4.5 out of 10. The guitar shall start with a 7 measure weight, but after weight you first get a lot of fun and simple single engines mixed in with some short sustains, an occasional chord. After a little while you will get another single changes riff, just this time with a lot more chords thrown into the mix. The chorus does have some long chord sustains though, and the shot does have some long and measured breaks here and there, but the single changes sections are super fun. Right before the drum solo, you get another mix of single note and chord changes, just with some hammer-ons as well. Overall the sustains and breaks in the song does hurt the score a little bit, but I can really recommend this song if you want a simple but enjoyable guitar chart, and that's why I give the chart a 7.5 of the time. In summary, Under Pressure is really good on guitar and drums, but a little bit below average on bass. But I think new expert players will still be able to find some enjoyment from the bass shot. I give Under Pressure by Queen a total score of a solid 6.2 out of 10. But that's all for me today, make sure as always to like, share and subscribe for more up and news and reviews in the future, and tell us in the comments your thoughts of this DLC single. Check out our full Queen Mod playlist here, and see you next time with the review of the show must go on.